Bringing home the bacon. Welcome to bringing home the bacon. This is Fortnite Battle Royale, where only the strongest survive. Hopped out of the battle bus, went to the factories to the northeast of Flush Factory. And uh, this is my normal route. I typically go into this building, hammer through. There's a chest right there. Hop in there and then run down and run to the building to the south. Now, while I was in there, didn't see a chest, but I did see someone running into this building to the south. So I was like, well, I'm just going to go try to have this one on one and see if I can win this this early matchup. Sure enough, he runs toward me in the bathroom. I open the door. I have a TAC SMG. He has a semi-auto pistol. I win that matchup. Went to the uh, big factory area uh, near uh, the north end of the town. I spy that uh, graffiti crate. And I could hear someone walking outside of me. They're going to go to this far corner near that crate up there. You can see their head right there. I figured I was at a bad, in a bad position. They can see more of me than I could see of them. So... I decided to drop down, got one more pop on him. Now I decided I was going to use steps to hop up and over, switch to a shotgun, two shot, three shots, and they go down. Now they had a scar too, so I was just absolutely loving that. Uh, a little bit later, I see um, someone shooting at me uh, from the area that I left, one of the hills. This is like this little, I don't know, rinky dink uh, town that's uh, in between the chair and uh, Flush Factory. And this guy sets up. Then I start getting shot in my back. So there's someone over by the chair. I'm sandwiched. I decide to run toward the buildings instead of staying out in the open. Pop a quick mini. And uh, this person has rockets. So the storm is closing in. I have a scar, which is you know the best weapon I have right now. Arguably that of the hunting rifle. Got two shots off on this person running. And I was like, well, they got to run. I got to run. So I think I'm just going to pursue them and see how much damage I can do uh, because I know they're just probably hot tailing it out thinking that I'm going to do the same instead of pursuing them. So here's the key. That's exactly what they did. They thought I was going to continue running. They stopped building. They actually building a wall to their right. You see, they thought I was to the right. And instead, I got behind them. The storm is not potent enough to kill me right now. So... This is a great opportunity for me. And they had those rockets. Now he goes down. I don't know where this person was at. And I'm like, okay, well, maybe I can do some quick, quick hopping. End up uh, figuring out where that person was. They're up on this little uh, hut. And uh, I'm, I'm low on health now. I'm not terribly uh, uh, worried about dying right now. I'm just qu trying to quickly build. You guys see I have like, I had like 800 wood going into this. So I just built up took my time once i was in a spot to realize that they couldn't do anything i healed up and uh, you know i got full med kits i got the shield so i popped my shield i got my scar as long as I, I got the scar in this situation i felt pretty confident so i knocked that down knocked them into uh that hut got two taps on them and then they started running behind all this stuff that they built up and uh man i got a headshot right there and i couldn't couldn't ask for a better uh, kill there now, I went back into the storm, grabbed that person's rockets. I did not forget about those rockets. That's super key um, for this particular game. And I would advise doing that um, if you have something like I have, which was three jump pads. <laughs> so use that jump pad, got out of dodge, ended up going for a far snipe when I landed. Um, this person set up and I just like, okay, well, I'm just going to use another jump pad on them. I could have probably used it earlier there. I set up, I moved up a little bit and set up again. Missed a couple shotgun shots, which could have cost me right there. I had maybe two shots before they really could react. So I needed those two shots to count. So a little bit better on the aiming there. I would have cleaned that up a lot smoother. So this person has guided rockets. You guys remember last video, I was talking to you guys about pursuing people with uh, guided rockets. This person, while they didn't set up like the other one, I did manage to, to uh, sneak up on him effectively and take his guided rockets, which are going to definitely come in handy later in this match. Now, I have someone shooting at me with a semi-auto snipe. I don't want to really take that fight right now. Uh, so I built up on the mountain and uh, tried to see if I could go to the last known position that I saw them in. Rather than shooting off the guided rockets, uh, I see them up top on me. So I just slowly pursue. I was listening waiting patiently and you guys see I'm, I'm slightly sidestepping so they can't hear my footsteps now as I'm moving more fluidly they can hear my footsteps but when you just do that little side shuffle 
um, no one can hear your footsteps. So you can kind of inch your way over there. It's super slow, but it can be effective when you're trying to reposition. Now, he actually has advantage here. He can see me before I can see him because he's sitting up on that slight slope. But man, he had a lot of stuff. Chug Jug. Uh, he had a shield. I just filled up on the shield. Set up in this. Shoot my god at rockets just to get a uh, an idea of where people are at. There's only uh, three of us now. Two other uh, enemies. And uh, I see this person building up. So I was like, oh, this is going to be an easy one. Boom. Hit him once. I go for the follow-up rocket before I decide I'm going to push in. Went on the other side of the mountain so they kind of confused him. As you can see, they're like, oh, this guy is actually pretty close over here. So he runs away. I ended up pursuing him. Hopped across the mountain. Got one little headshot tink on him with the uh, scar. Switched to my shotgun. A little, little far uh, in, this, in this, but I managed to clean him up with four or five shots there with the shoddy. And now there's only two of us left. And this last person is uh, uh, across the circle. So again, I'm going to use... Uh, the guided missiles, I saw him building right there to the south of me. So I set up uh, some steel uh, buildings. Feeling pretty good about that that steel because I got a lot of it left. So before I built the steps, I wanted to uh, shoot one missile off at him. Just to kind of scare him. Let him know I had a homing missile for him. Just waiting for him. Uh, and I left his roof up right up until the last minute. Just one wall of me. So I was like, oh, I'm not going to spend 16 seconds trying to shoot another one. Uh, at that same position, so I wanted to see if he would move, and uh, I, I changed directions on this one, so I didn't come from the same angle. Sure enough, he did start moving, and uh, he quickly built up. I tried to swing around on the side that I thought I could catch him off guard. Switched up my style here. Uh, I'm not going to shoot any more rockets. I'm going to switch to Scar because it looks like he's trying to pursue me. And this is this is pretty much all she wrote. I'm just going to continue using this scar. I'm in a great position. I'm not going to fall. There is a floor beneath me. Uh, so even if he shoots underneath me, which he can't, I was still in in a good position to uh, uh, continue to, to rain down from above on this mountaintop. And missing a lot of my shots, I set up, slowed down, got that first shot accuracy on that one, waited for my reticle to... Uh, to uh, hone in a little bit so I could could accurately get him and then just cleaned him up. I just kept peppering uh, everything he was building there and I moseyed on down and you know, I got a taunt for the win. Disco fever. Hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay. If you did, please make sure to leave a like, subscribe so you guys don't miss any more of my Fortnite Battle Royale gameplay. And until the next time, folks, I will catch you all later. Stay frosty. Battle. This is Battle Royale. Battle. Battle Royale. Battle.